Hi, I'm Peggy Farron with Understand Photography. I'm going to show you how to paint in Photoshop CS6. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is open the picture that we want to paint. So file, open. I'm going to look here in our Everglades folder and choose this little frog that Joe Fitzpatrick, our Everglades leader, took. Okay, um, I need to make, come over here to the Layers palette, and you're going to click on Create New Layer. Just left click on it one time because you want to create a blank layer. Okay, so just left click, and there you have a blank layer. You can see it's blank by the little checkerboard pattern there. Okay, the next step is to come over here to your brush tool and choose Mixer Brush Tool. You see that? Pretty cool looking. Come up here to the top. You want to make sure Sample All Layers is clicked, Flow 100, Mix 90, Load 75, Wet 80, Custom, and then these two buttons, you want to make sure that they're dark. This button is for cleaning the brush after each stroke, and this is for loading the brush after each stroke. And then you can leave the rest of the top menu alone. All right. Um, you're going to choose right here, kind of towards the top, the round, blunt, medium, stiff brush. So left click on that, and then come back to your photograph, and you can just start painting. And the way to paint is just to hold the left um, side of your mouse down and then release it when you want to quit painting. So you see I'm just making a bunch of little strokes here, turning this background, kind of looking into paint. Now I use my bracket key to make the paint brush bigger, but it also um, kind of separates the bristles so it's not as smooth. So I zoom in, I'm going to make, we use my bracket key to make the brush smaller, and I'm just going to paint. It's a little tedious, but it's really, really a cool effect, so it's worth it. So I'm just going to keep painting my little frog, my little Everglades frog, and you have to be careful in the, you know, the detailed areas here, but you want that painterly look, so um, just keep stroking, stroking, just like you would paint, but you're using your mouse or if you have a stylus and um, tablet, that might work as well. Might work easier, actually. Um, so just keep, keep going, keep going, keep going. You can try cross-stitching and all kinds of different uh, brush strokes and make the brush smaller by using the bracket key. When you get in, and if you make a mistake, you can you can just kind of paint over it again. You see that? And just keep going. It 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 is very time consuming. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and just show you the one that I finished. <laughs> I think that might be a little quicker. I'm gonna come to File, Open Recent, and this is my painted frog, and that's before and after.